Good morning and happy Thursday folks. It is the 31st of December, so it's New Year's Eve. And rather a strange one this year because we've woken up in tier four. So we've got tier four restrictions, which basically shuts everything down except supermarkets uh, for groceries and takeaway food. Everything else has been closed down. So yeah, it's going to be a bit of a subdued new year tonight. Not sure what we're going to do. Not sure where I can go. We are allowed out for exercise and things like this. But I won't be going to Beamish. I won't be going to any sort of museums or castles or anything like this. The only sort of things I can do is take you out for walks again. Like we were in the first lockdown. So time will tell how these vlogs are going to pan out it may just be geocaching i know some of you may be getting bored of the geocaching but it is something to do and an excuse and a reason to actually get out and walk and, and do the exercise so yeah we'll see how things pan out yep that's a mini ice cream van that's been converted to sell alcohol hmm one way around a the bar's closing I suppose it's a mobile bar sorry I've not picked you up much tonight but there's nothing much interesting happened it's still just raining there's no snow as promised so I'm a bit gutted about that I thought we were going to be knee deep in the white stuff but no just damp and cold Emma's been cooking yum Next morning. Good morning and Happy New Year everybody. Well, it's a cold wet one in tier 4 restrictions, so not the normal new year. Not sure what we'll be able to do because technically everywhere shut. Not technically everywhere is shut. It's not a technicality, it's a reality. So I'm just gonna have to figure out places to go walking, go geocaching, and I might get some drone footage. But maybe not all today. Me and Gypsy's come back to Gallagher Park in Bedlam, my hometown. We're going to have a walk up the top of the pit heap. There's a bench up there, and I'm going to mark the coordinates because I'm going to start setting my own geocaches for people to find. So that's where I'm going to put one. Oh, and I've just seen a red squirrel. Wow. Go on, Gypsy. And it's a little bit cloudy. That's muddy to everybody else. I'm just watching that squirrel. Don't want to frighten it because it's, it's a red, which is our native ones, which are endangered by the American grey squirrel. Cool. It's pointless turning you around because you don't see it. It's over there on that bit of grass. But this camera doesn't have a zoom lens, so you'll not be able to see it. Come on, Gypsy. So yeah, come with us. Well, we made it to the top of the pit heap. As usual, it's windy up here. Every time we come up here, it's always windy. But look at the views. So, I was going to get the drone out, but Go on, I'll give it a go. I'll give the drone a go. Hopefully it doesn't get blown too much. Uh, yeah. See what happens. Oh, and this is where I'm going to set that cache. A pew with a view.
please excuse the wild hair because the wind has made it windswept and interesting anywho hope you enjoyed that little drone video i had to stop because my phone battery started going flat and if you know anything about dji drones you know that the controller plugs into your phone and uses your vo uses your phone oh, my face is frozen I had to stop because my phone battery went flat and if you know anything about DJI drones you'll realize that you have to plug your phone into your controller and that's your viewfinder and it's how you set the, set the drone up and what have you and what you can see through the drone camera what's weird is I'm, I'm gonna sound like a, a nutter here but my phone battery was on about 80% and then it went flat whilst flying the drone after about a six or seven minute flight which doesn't normally happen then my GoPro battery which I'm filming this on uh, that's just dropped from 53% to zero whilst I was filming you it actually said 53% and then it went beep 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 battery flat so that's two batteries gone flat when they shouldn't have What's going on? Luckily I've got a spare battery with me, which is how I'm filming this, but why is all my batteries going flat? Is it the cold? The cold make the batteries just suddenly go from like 80 and 50% down to zero instantly? I don't know. Well, I'm walking back up the top of the pit by Gallagher Park to place that geocache I've submitted it for review so hopefully they're going to say yes to it but apparently you've got to place the cache before the sub before you submit the view blah, blah, speaking alien before you submit the review hold on don't know I'm walking <laughs> um, so yeah I'm having to go all the way back up look what I got for Christmas a beauty light for vlogging at home for the home vlogs Look how bright it is. <laughs> Am I beautiful? Doesn't make my eyes a sparkle green? My hair beautiful? <laughs> well, me and Emma's just watched the latest Bad Boys. Bad Boys for Life? Bad Boys for Life. Latest Bad Boys movie. And it was... Eh. So we're trying to find films which are going to grip us because we haven't seen any decent films for a while so in the comments down below leave a suggestion for a really good film don't like horrors so not a horror Emma likes the horrors not me and we'll give it a try we'll see what the weather's like tomorrow to see if we can get out somewhere um, but we are still in tier 4 we're going to be in tier 4 for the next month I think it is so where we can go is going to be pretty limited and obviously the weather's supposed to be pants for the next eight or nine days according to the, the iPhone weather app so we'll see what we can do see where we can get to like I said I think it was in yesterday's vlog it's probably just going to be geocaching and wandering around for the minute so we'll see what tomorrow brings so hopefully I will see you all tomorrow now it's time to do your job